Hey there, e-waste explorers. Welcome back to our channel, where we dive deep into the electronic waste world to bring you the coolest insights and updates. Today, we're talking about something you might not have paid much attention to, but is actually super interesting. The colors of motherboards. Why are some motherboards brown, yellow, blue, or green? Stay tuned to find out. Did you know that the color of a motherboard can impact its performance and durability? Yeah, you heard that right. Make sure to watch till the end, because we're uncovering some surprising facts that might change the way you look at your PC build forever. And hey, don't forget to smash that like button if you love e-waste as much as we do. So, let's start with the basics. The color of a motherboard is determined by the solder mask, a protective layer that's applied to the board. This mask not only gives the board its color, but also insulates and protects the copper traces from corrosion and damage. Now, why do manufacturers use different colors? It's not just for aesthetics, although that's a big part of it. Each color has its own set of characteristics. For example, green is the most common color because it's cost-effective and provides a good balance between performance and durability. Fun fact, green solder masks are used in over 70% of motherboards worldwide. Let's break down the specifics. Green, most common, cost-effective, and offers reliable performance, used in over 70% of motherboards. Brown, less common, but provides a matte finish that reduces glare. It's often used in older or budget models. Yellow, rare, and often seen in high-end or specialized boards. It's known for being aesthetically unique and providing a distinct look. Blue, popular in gaming and enthusiast boards. It's not just about looks. Blue masks can help with heat dissipation and signal clarity. Does the color really affect performance? Yes and no. The color itself doesn't directly impact performance, but the quality of the solder mask does. High quality masks can improve thermal management and reduce electrical interference. For example, blue masks, used in many high-end gaming motherboards, are known for their superior heat dissipation properties. So, there you have it folks. The next time you look at a motherboard, you'll know why it's colored the way it is. Now, we want to hear from you. What's the color of your motherboard? Do you think it makes a difference? Drop your answers in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe for more e-waste insights. Hit that bell icon to stay updated with our latest videos. Thanks for watching, and as always, Keep exploring the e-waste world with us. See you in the next video.